My name is Zach Orji, and I'd like to encourage you to watch quality Nollywood movies on Sony Reaching Nolly TV. My name is Frederick. My name is Yo, Yo, Edoche. Go and subscribe to Sony Richie Nolly TV. Hola. Oh, my name is Enkiru. Once again, you're welcome. Ah, this is where we live. Now I have to be this old. <laughs> Food not there yet, but let me make a movie for you. Please go and beg your dad. Don't get off that phone. I don't suffer for you. Sorry, sorry. This is not your house. Let's slap that Let me get you. Okay, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> 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 You don't want to eat four Ah, not like. Yes, Where did they come from? Vice principal is not a fluke. You understand me? No problem. Okay? Hmm. Bullocks try me in my school. It's okay. It's okay. Nika, Nika! The only most educated man in the whole village. Hey! I met you well, though. You did not meet me well. It's just that you did not meet me well, okay? If meeting me well to you involves eating this food, there's no space. You understand me? There's no space. Because I am hungry and I am angry. Please, please. Is it because of uh, ordinary food that your, your frowning face and opening eye for me? You don't even know why I'm here. I don't want to know. You understand me? I have no interest in knowing. Everybody knows you're a loafer. So if you have loafed around and you ended up here to eat this, there's no space. I am hungry and I'm angry. Please. I cannot loaf. I walk. When I'm coming here, I walk. I walk in. I do not loaf in. Meanwhile, you are hungry and angry. What happened? That can wait until I finish. Okay? Okay, since you say so, let me keep my first class information to myself. Me better. Uh, I would have told you that I have seen the men that play music for your students. I don't want to ask who let a bag of non-entities open right now. You understand me? If you have anything to say, you say it, but forget about this food. Alright? Thank you. Please, please, and please. See, what, I'm, what I want to say is very important too. I mean to tell you that I have seen the sugar daddies of your students. You know you sound more intelligent when you keep quiet. Alright? Mm. I'm not used to rumors. I don't have time for it. So please, 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 if you have nothing to say, please exit out of here. Thank you. I'm serious, so. I now know the sugar daddy of Chika Okafo and uh, and the Ngozi Madoka. I'm telling you the truth. Chika Okafo, Ngozi Madoka, friends to uh, Choma. 
I know they are sugar daddies now. Come out with it. Come on, come on, come on, come out. Tell, 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 tell me what I'm telling me to come out. Come out with me. Tell me what you have to say, please, please. How can I tell you what I have to say? You said you're angry and hungry. I can't be telling you. Come on, come, come down, come down. This is for you. Go on. Yeah. Go on, feed me the information. Yeah. Hmm. It's a very big something today. Okay? Yes, yes. Oh. You mean this? Huh. Boy called him Nicholas and said he's the vice principal of the school. Hmm. Yes, so he's a troublemaker. But maybe you shouldn't have gotten into trouble with him now. Why? Because he's the vice principal of the school. <laughs> Don't worry. I will show him the stuff I am made of. Hmm. Uh, when would this guy ever reason well? Babes, I heard he doesn't have a wife. He doesn't even have a girlfriend. He lives all alone because he has no parents. Yes. How does that even concern you? Because I asked him for an address. <laughs> Babe. He will know me. Don't worry. Babe, I beg. When you go to school tomorrow, please don't challenge him. Yes. Or else he will reject you. I will be hard for you to get another piece of primary assignment. He can't. He can't reject me. He cannot reject me when the government sent me there. Um, calm down. See, that's the procedure. If the school doesn't accept you, then you take yourself to the local government with your rejection later. And then they will post you to another school. That's how it's done. Really? Yes. Okay. So I'll wait till they accept me then. Once they accept me, I am going to teach him a very bitter lesson. Not just him. The entire village. Because I realize that they don't have sense in that village. So if they don't have sense, they're going to have to pick sense outside. Common sense is plenty everywhere. They'll pick it and put it in their head. You see now? This village is something else. Oh, we need to worry. tell you a lot about this. So you know how to <laughs> go about this. Okay. Yes. I am fine. When two married people meet, one must be the senior and the other the junior, right? Babe, hmm. calm down. Don't worry. Calm down, no. Calm down. Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. I'm on a feather picking up. And why is you actually see them? I mean, I say you saw them yourself or somebody told you. No, 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 no. Me. I told you. First hand information. I saw them with my two naked eyes. I did win a half moon. I would have video them and show you. Mm. have decided to put themselves on the pedestal of disturbing the concentration of my students, spoiling them. They don't put themselves on the pedestal. They deal with the girls. So what are we going to do? It's all right. I will show them, show them. that I am the vice principal of that school. I will show them that it is wrong to be under my canopy and misbehave. No problem. Yes. I will show them. Mm. Nico, anything that you want to do, do it fast. I mean, those girls are too small for those good men. I mean, why it's not even good for the reputation of your school. It's too, too appalling. Very appalling. It's appalling, please. It's appalling. Appalling. Say up. Appalling. Up. Up. You call it down. You get water. No, no, no. How is that? The vitamin givers. What do you expect? When you see vitamin givers, you know that there is something to talk. What are you talking? Vitamin giver. Eh? Because with the way I saw her, yes. 
It's like her local government headquarters. <laughs> Still very far <laughs> Let me warn the two of you. This environment no. uh, is territory. Yes. And jurisdiction is not safe. It's not safe for this kind of discussion. Let's leave it and concentrate on these sumptuous meals. Uh, okay, I understand. It's not safe for you. But, but it's safe for two of us. Eh? Two of us. <laughs> it's safe for us. <laughs> we are a team now. If it's not safe for us, it's not safe for all. Okay, I will just play your legs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you are supposed to look less like you were telling me. Yes, of course. Um, um, mm -hmm. uh, who is this? We need to go back because we have people here. Which people? It's not principal office. I knocked before I entered. You did not knock before you entered. If you knocked, definitely the only reasonable thing is for you to hear a response. But since there was no response, you have to go back before coming in here. When you hear a response, whenever that comes, then you can come in. No, this is an office, not the bedroom. Not the room, the office. Madam, please, please, please. I mean, you know this is not normal. Now, now the question is, how long did you stay in that egg before it hatched? Because I know it wasn't even up to nine months before the egg hatched. A chicken, I be. Of course. Yes. You're behaving like what? Yes. Now get out of here. Let, 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 let us have our discussion. I will not do that. I will not do that. Madam Prisma, can, can you imagine? Madam Prisma, can, can you imagine? Is this some behavior like, like, like? I don't respect you enough. Madam Prisma, please. My God. Yes, ma'am. He is my first principal. Thank you. Why you don't talk to me? I'll talk to him like that, madam. This man is a very, very foolish man. A foolish man he is. Imagine yesterday when I came here. I walked around this whole village looking for this address. I saw this useless man along the way pushing his rotten bicycle. I asked him, give me direction to this school. And he started insulting me. Because we are asking block questions. You were asking block and block questions. Don't call me that again. Block. Don't call me that. Block. Get out of here, man. I said, get out of here. I said, get out of here, said, get out of here right now. Come on, Christmas, tell her to get out of here. Come on, because come here. I need to discuss with my principal. Me to Leave me. here. I'm government approved. That's why I'm here. Government approved to assist the government here. For what? It's okay. Please, Mr. Nicholas, can you just excuse me a few minutes? I'd like to talk to her. Mm. I know what she's saying. Madam, have you been hypnotized? Thank you, Principal. Have you been hypnotized? No, I will not do that. That's impossible. How can a vice principal leave for a copper? What did I tell you? A, a, a copper. For what, what reason? What did I tell you? No, Madam, I have been hypnotized. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? Madam, I keep telling you, please, please, what please, go to church. Go to church. Break it. Do it. This is hypnosis. This is Libya, my friend. I said Libya. Libya, 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 you are here to see me. As you can see, I'm going to somewhere very important. And we are here for something very important. So very, very to important. Listen to us. Why do you you come out and put open eye for me? I don't understand. See, let me tell you, people. You can't use me to do a susu. Eh? The only language I understand now is when you call me eight years now, and I answer yes. You tell me go to our office and carry your boss. Anything other than that, I'm not interested. Yeah, 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 eight I don't know who you are forming garagara for. I'm a mama kenanya kenanya ziri mozo. What is your problem? We are here to discuss something important with you and you, and you, you are forming this boss. Like, don't carry your boss. Which boss? Don't carry your you boss. want to give me the boss free? Are you giving it to me free? Oh, I can see your plans. Anytime you look at your pocket, uh, there is nothing inside your pocket. If you will remember that the uh, boss is being seized by the task force, and uh, if you will not come here and collect the little one that I have, it will not work this time around. At uh, the matter of fact, you should leave my, 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 my house. Is this your house? Is this not your father's house? It is better that I am living in my father's house than to be a thief. Don't you think I don't know why they call you bullets? It's because you're a criminal. That's why they call you bullets. You, I, your news is everywhere. Everybody knows. I can't know they're not they're not they're Did you just insult us? No, I did not insult you. I don't use you to leave my house. Did you just insult us? If you call me even fool, I, I go tender for you. You go tender you for You want who? to fight? You go tender for who? You want to fight? Eh? You, you people should leave, oh. You people should leave, oh. I know what. This, you want to fight? Come on, we'll come on here. You people should leave. I'll go bring my papa then go, no. You people should leave, oh. You're not going to see your boss again. Thunder fire you. You're not going to see your boss again. Thunder fire you. Kiss him goodbye. I beg you, come on. Kiss him goodbye. Thunder fire you. Kiss him goodbye. Thunder fire you.
Help your life first. We let us first. You know, go see work, do. Huh? What do I? These guys, they won't fight me for here. Hey, hey, get out. Friend, kneel down. Kneel down, my friend. Raise your hands. Where are your partners? They're too accomplice. Oh. Chica, Shoma, my question. Where were you yesterday? Sir. Sir. Will you shut up, you kangaroo? Now, Chica. Sir. Answer me this minute. My question again. Where were you and who were those men? Uh, sir, they are my uncles. Your uncles? Huh? Yes. My uncles, sir. Yes. <laughs> Your uncles, Dego and Abasi, are now your uncles. Chief, Dego and Abasi, your uncles. So, you now go with your uncles to corners, wrong corners, in our prestigious school uniform. Huh? That is your modus operandi right now, isn't it? Eh? Sir, we are sorry. We won't do it again. We are sorry. You are sorry. Sir, I was not a monk. Oh. You shut up, kangaroo. You won't do it again. You weren't a monk. You won't do it again. You weren't a monk. Yes, 152 million dogs in the world. How fascinating is it for me to know one? You, one, Ngozi, you. Anyway, I don't have time for cheap talk. Now, crawl like a dog you are. I'm calm. Right in front of me. Move, move, crawl, 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 crawl. Move. Crawl like a baby. Yes. I'm sorry. I said stay there. No, 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 no. Stay in that position. So what, I want that position just the way you are. Move forward. Crawl, my friend. So please, I'm Good. sorry. Now in that position you are. Stay in that position, my friend. Put your hand on the ground. So we are sorry. Put your hand on the ground. So we are sorry. Now. What will befall three of you? You will have 12 strokes of the cane, and I will still report to the principal. Then you will be expelled from the school. Yeah, please, sir, now we are sorry. Sir, yeah, we are sorry. If you move your hand, I double it. Sir, please, sir, please. Sir, please, sir, please. Sir, we are sorry. Four girls on their bum bum. You don't know it's wrong. Bullock. Don't come down on me. Pluck. Don't call me that. Pluck, pluck. Do you realize I'm the vice principal of this school? Do you realize that? Uh huh. So the vice principal and come. So you now begin to flog girls on their bumper. It's bad now. It's not right. Now, Bullock, listen here. You see this school you've met so pretty. Mm. Okay? Mm. It's my alma mater too. The beautification you have met mm. is due to the fact that I discussed with my good friend and classmate the executive governor of this state. Yes. Now, you don't want to put yourself into more trouble. Okay? Uh. Stay away from me. I am not normal. Forget I'm well dressed. I am not normal. Uh -huh. I am mad. You are making a mistake. <laughs> you know that me, I'm crazy. <laughs> you know that. Where they gave birth to me, it's crazy people that used to stay here. I'm crazy as you see me so. Forget. My person bone is in my back. You are not mad. Me, I'm crazy. Okay. No flock girls on their bumper. It's wrong. Okay. Okay. Alright. Now, you female kangaroos into my office. Classes are over for today. Move it! Okay. I get out. It's your nose like flying boots. And he's rushing the Yeah, get that. Get that. If you come here, I'll slap you. SS3 kangaroos to my office immediately. Okay. See this your neck, the hands wrong. I flog you to the neck. Long like ostrich. You want to graduate from this school? Yes, sir. You. You know you failed twice. Same class. Two times. Okay? And you, you failed three times. You only once. That is why you stay behind the class. Do you want to be behind the light? Now, into my office immediately. 
Like what you speak. My spit is snake venom. If your eye ever open again, no, I'm not your mommy. Just come. Come. I said into my office. Why is this? You see that copper? That copper? Yes, yes, the, the one with, 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 this, with this stupidly painted hair. She must be rejected. Let her be sent back to the asylum she came from. Else, I'll kill her. No, you won't do such a thing. What about kill her? You're not a murderer. Madam, can you just imagine? Can you imagine? Can you just in, 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 your, in your single imagination just imagine that she had the infantry, the temerity to stop me from, from, from scolding students? What? A copper? Why did she do that? I don't understand, madam. And whenever she told me you saw her yesterday. All lies, madam. All lies. All lies. All lies. Listen, madam, I'll tell you this for real. This person graduated from a school that is nothing but an asylum. Yes, she came from an asylum. I know what I'm saying. She has to leave here. Let us send her away because she displays nothing but gross foolishness and stupidity. This is a representative of, 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 of an absolute idiot let out of a stupid bag or call the university. Mr. Nicholas, please. With this, what do we do? We needed coppers, but we can't afford them. We can't pay them. And that was the reason we requested for one. I don't know what stuff she's made of, but I beg you, please, allow her to stay. I don't know what is wrong with her. Sometimes she behaves. Like somebody that has mental. She is mental. mental. She's I mental. How she graduated? I don't know. I don't know because there's nothing in that head but sawdust. That that head is empty. Madam, please, I don't want you visiting me in a police station, police cell, whatever. It's not prison. Please, please, please. I will kill that girl. Send her back. You won't do such thing. I've just asked you to allow her to stay. We will know how to do it. Madam. You're not a murderer. Madam. I think we have allowed this issue to linger for too long. We have allowed it to linger for too long. With the way our women are going about it, particularly our wives, we are not safe anymore, ago. We are not safe. So I, I want to strongly suggest that we start the implementation of this law immediately to act as deterrent and stop their excesses. Eh? Very correct. Ibu. Yes, he's right. You see, we as men, tradition allows us to marry as many women as we want. And have as many concubines as we want as well. It's our traditional right. And it is legal. But for a woman, it's a taboo. See, it is not just God has solved the mathematics. Go to the animal kingdom. You will see a lion with so many female folks around it. It got to the extent that, in fact, I was watching a documentary. The female lion, like the lioness, will kill an animal, bring it to the male. The male will eat to its satisfaction before they will venture, you know, put their mouth into it. Now, let's not go far. Let's go. See the cock. Only one cock services several hands. <laughs> you understand? Correct. That's the way God has solved the mathematics. So what are we talking about? Oh. Huh? It's also in the Bible. That Solomon had so many wives. 300. Cockbacks without number there. 700. Oh, you, you went to school. Well. Altogether 1,000. <laughs> You can imagine that's it. So, we as men, we have the right now to impose these laws on the women of this village. Let it be official. Hmm. Igwe, it's not as if I'm in support of our women seeing other men. No. Our wives being unfaithful <coughs> to we, their husband, I see other men. Oh, why are you say see, see, see? Just speak the obvious. Sleeping with other men, cheating. That's you want to color it, see, see, see with their eyes or what? It's the same thing, Amber It's not. It's not. Um, Iwe, about this tradition we are talking about implementing, I'm not in support of it either. 
Igwe, let's look at it the other way. It does not make any sense. <coughs> um, Igwe, I think we have more pressing issues on hand. Things that are more serious, that is affecting the lives of our people, that required urgent attention. And that is what we are here for. I'm not discussing women. We have spent almost two hours talking irrelevant things. Why? Bia, bia, bia. You call this discussion irrelevant? Yes, it oh. oh. hey. What are you talking about? That we are discussing irrelevant things. So you are indirectly accusing our Igwe of discussing irrelevant things. You can imagine. Hold on. I am talking to this my gentleman, not you. Itego, I want to ask you. I don't think you came from the city to discuss this. Do you? Answer me! My elders, I want you all to calm down. We must be very wise and tactical in handling this issue. Because it's a very sensitive one. In fact, we'll fix a date for the next meeting. And when we reconvey, we shall deliberate on this particular issue. Uh, for now, I need to go in and get set for my next meeting. Would you say the next one? And moreover, the secretary is not here to document our deliberations. This meeting is over. Yes, Igwe, I quite agree with you. I mean, just quiet, it just Igwe. I agree with you, Igwe. Do not love that. Let her let people. Okay, sir. It's not like you're, I'm, I'm even doing any bad thing. Mm. We're not doing any bad thing. I'm, I'm still single. Huh? And I went to the school. You understand? And I told myself that I must, I must, you know, marry somebody from the school. I mean, you fit this. <laughs> Me? Yes! I mean, I mean, you, I mean, you fit the, the right specimen of a wife. I'm so happy. Of course, you should be. Huh? Should be. Alright, just be a good girl, okay? Okay, sir. Now, I tell you, nobody will touch you in this school. Nobody. Not even that block or block of, of a copper. You understand me? Okay, sir. Yes. See, let me tell you, many of these teachers, they disturb me. That, yes, they want me. They know I'm, they know I'm, I'm single and hot. You know. Huh? I'm so, lucky, you know, sir. Consider yourself lucky, yes. Oh.